Former First Lady Michelle Obama is in town for a screening of her documentary on New Orleans musician and Grammy winner John Batiste. It's called American Symphony. The documentary chronicles Batiste's relationship with his wife as she's battling cancer and he's composing a symphony at Carnegie Hall, the American Symphony. WGNO's Kenny Lopez is at the Orpheum Theater for that screening tonight. Kenny. Hey, Kurt and Susie. Oh, what a night it is going to be with former First Lady Michelle Obama and Grammy Award winner John Batiste. Lots of excitement already in the theater. Uh, so far, uh, Michelle Obama and uh, John Batiste have not arrived yet, but they're all here for this new film. It's going to be a tearjerker. That's what we're being told. It's called American Symphony. Symphony. Now, the film takes place in early 2022 when multi-instrumentalist and New Orleans native John Batiste, he went to St. Aug, finds himself the most celebrated artist of the year with 11 Grammy nominations. His next project was to compose an original symphony at Carnegie Hall in New York City. While all this is going on, his wife Salika Jiao's cancer ended up coming out of remission and it returned. The new documentary is now streaming on Netflix and American Symphony follows the couple's journey together and it showcases their vulnerability and rawness through all the highs and the lows. Now, former First Lady Michelle Obama's involvement is her production company is called Higher Ground, so that is why she is going to be here. We're already being told that she will not be doing interviews, but she will walk the red carpet with John and do photo opportunities. As for John Batiste, we're going to get to talk to him, and I really want to ask him how he feels that his music is healing, especially for his wife, but for also his fans and maybe other people people that are going through cancer or families that have dealt with cancer. And get this, Kurt and Susie, guess where John Batiste and his wife met? In band camp when they were teenagers. Wow. What a love story this is sure to be. Of a big night downtown. Thank yeah. you, Kenny.